What's up, guys? Matt here, bringing you my second episode on YouTube. This episode episode's gonna be a tutorial on how to download texture packs for Minecraft. Okay. First off, you go to your web browser, pull it up. I'm gonna put the link in this website to the description. It will be like right to how to download it, or right to the download button. It, this is the website I have it already copied, or then I just pasted it there. But all you have to do is click on it, and it'll bring it here. Then, when you get here, this is the light theme. Like this is dark, and then high. This one I don't know what it is. Don't even worry about it. My favorite is the light, and that's most people's favorite, the most popular. Just click on it. And then if you have Rinrar and you're using mozzarella, I think Google Chrome will download it. But you're gonna click Save File, and then just click OK. This one was my favorite one. What? Okay. Once this saves. And it should be in your downloads folder. I hope it does. Okay, don't crap right there. And then it'll appear in your downloads folder. I'm just gonna close that. And then you can just go to downloads. And it'll be in Dokacraft. And then you drag it on your desktop. Like I just did. Then you're gonna open up Minecraft. And go to texture packs, open texture pack folder, take this, drag it into here. And then it'll pop up, and then you see I already have all these, I have this one. So I'm just going to go ahead and recycle that. And then it'll pop up in here, you just select it, like let's say this is Doka Craft, well, we'll just do it. Let's say that's your Doka Craft one, you click on it, press it down, and you got your Doka Craft thing. And then... That's how you do that. And actually, you're gonna need WinRAR Archiver, I think it is. That's how you pronounce it, something like that. And I'll put a link in the description on that too. And I think you can just go to, if I don't put the link in the description, you can just go to Google and put WinRAR download. Oh, shit. I don't think it matters when I put free. I don't know. I'm just gonna make sure. And then you just click on it. And then you just download it. It's pretty easy, but that's the easiest one I know how to use. But you have to have that, I'm pretty sure. And you can do this. For, this is basically the same for all texture packs, except this one's kind of unique because you have to enter that surface thing. But if you, certain thing. But if you want to have a different one, go to planetminecraft.com. Like that, and I'll put another link in the description of that. And then you're gonna want to click on texture packs. And then there's a whole bunch, just a lot. And you can go to recently updated, most popular, most views, most downloaded. I usually click most popular, and that'll bring you all the most popular. I recommend not getting this LB photo reel unless you have a really good computer because even with my computer, it's one of the newest Dell computers, it will lag up your computer. That's what it does to me. I open it, it's like, can't even play it. That's how bad it is. I put the render distance on tiny, it's still really laggy. Another thing you're going to need, no, is that it? Yeah, and then you just take that, the same thing, it'll download. You drag it on your desktop and then drag it into your Minecraft texture pack folder. And that's how you do that. And in the next video, I'm going to be showing you how to download single player commands. So, I hope you guys liked this video, and I hope it liked you. Be sure to like and dislike if you don't like it. If you have any problems, comment below the video, and I'll reply on them. Or I'll make another video on how like, to fix that problem. So... But I only know how to do it for Windows 7. It should be the, basically the same for any other computer. But mostly that's all people have now is Windows 7. So, it doesn't really matter. Anyway, that's how you download texture packs. I hope you guys liked it and I hope it helped you. And it means a lot when you like it. So, thanks. And have a good rest of the day.